I'm Richard Scott. I'm an artist based in Cape Town, South Africa. And this is a gold tree that produces an artwork. And have you guys got any questions? So my question to you is, is your gold tree the most popular amongst all the other colors that you do? Um, it's kind of called the gold money tree. So people relate to it as like gold money, money tree kind of thing. So in that sense, it is the most popular, most sought after. It is quite bling bling. And as you can see, it's quite reflective. But yeah, it's, um, it's definitely the most popular of all the trees that I've produced in my 20 year career as an artist. Why do you make this type of art? Well, this piece is an extension of the gold tree that I do on a canvas. So, um, as you know, I no longer produce those gold trees on canvas. So this is a, it's a paper, piece of paper, artist paper, which we then hand paint. And then that's sent off to Wim Boote at Black River Studios, where they silk screen this tree in two colors, in black and in, in um, pearl. So it's kind of an extension, a more affordable option to the original piece on canvas and it allows you to produce a limited edition of that. So in this case it's an edition of 14, this is the 13th one, it's going for an auction tomorrow. So there's only one of these pieces left, 14 of 14. So the tree, where did you get your inspiration from the tree? I always loved trees, uh, sure. growing up as a kid. My best friends always had tree houses, and they were only my, only my best friends because they had tree houses. And I, I always loved trees. When I lived in Hart Bay, even today I travel through Hart Bay and along that path, like Coast and Bosch, and there's trees, massive trees. And then there's that crazy guy in America that makes tree houses for you. If you've got a, a weird house and a weird tree, he comes and makes a tree house, like a holiday home tree house. So I think, I don't know, it's just a connection to nature, but it's definitely something to do being a youngster, something back when I was a kid. Any more questions? The, the size of the artwork, why did you choose a specific size? My traditional size for the artworks are square on the canvas. So generally, um, the, uh, people will recognize my art as a, as a Richard Scott and they will be definitely confirmed that it's a Richard Scott because it's square. Here, I wanted to conform to the sizes of paper. Paper come in sort of A5, A4, so it's kind of landscape or portrait. So this is an AO piece of paper, just slightly bigger. And I kind of wanted to just stick to the traditions of paper because people's eyes and uh, subconscious vision of a tree in a landscape is a bit more sort of landscape-y paper size. So it's based on paper, but more also landscape and this link to the trees. Questions? What makes it a high art value? What makes it a high art value is my name is Richard Scott and I've created a brand over the last 20 years. And the brand is actually the black line and the white in the middle from the girls that I produce to the trees. So it becomes high art value because of the, 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 the effort and the work that I put into my brand and my art has escalated up to the some of the top levels in the world and people pay high prices for it and um, the other reason why it's high art value is because it's limited edition there's only 14 of them once you limit the editions your the prices go up um, yeah would you do another color in the same series yes this is the first of uh, many colors this is the first of the gold so we did the 14 and they're just about to sell out and then after this we'll either do the copper or the silver or probably the rose gold. So it will be the same principle and the tree will be in a different position, different location. But the background will also be hand painted in rose gold. And then silk screened on top, yeah. So as a collector you kind of want to collect all of them. The gold one, the pearl one, the copper one, the rose gold one. Okay. Quite cool. Thanks guys. It's uh, really cool.